Sometimes you just gotta go stand in traffic. Good morning, welcome back to the vlog. I'm Sean, this is Dream Cars Daily. And this is Kyle. How's it going? Kyle likes cars. Yes, I do. Kyle's going with us today. We're going to the Bentley Continental GT launch party at Perillo. And I thought I was going to be late. I downshifted in front of a police station. <laughs> and this new exhaust is so loud. Like, immediate, I downshifted and a cop whipped out right behind me. I was ready to call you and say, dude, I think I'm going to be late. <laughs> but uh. he followed me for about four or five blocks and then, and then dipped. So thankfully, no, yeah. no exhaust tickets this morning. That would suck. Yeah. New exhaust yesterday, get a ticket today. Uh. <laughs> Ferrari life. <laughs> anyway, you ready to go? I'll yeah, yeah. We're, let, let's pack up and get out. I need coffee. I always need coffee. Always. Hey, Kyle. You ever driven a Ferrari? No. Okay. No. Good. That makes it more fun. <laughs> go for it. You're not gonna. You're not gonna do it. I said go for it. The day I bought the car, I drove home and I kept it at like four or 5,000 RPM the whole ride. I was always like two gears less than where I needed to be because it sounded so awesome. And, yep. and I told my wife, I'm like, I'm like, no, like 5,000 RPM is just where that car wants to live. She's like, no, that's where you want it to be. I'm like, same thing. <laughs> Close enough. That is where it sounds amazing, and that's where I want it to be. So that's where it wants to live. With the new exhaust, it is significantly louder in here. I'm really hoping that uh, my audio comes through fairly well without the exhaust drowning it out. I know I'm about, I know I'm speaking at least like 10 decibels louder than I used to. <laughs> it sounds so good, but it's loud. And uh, with the top down, it's brutally loud. I love it. Right, so Kyle. We have to have a little conversation here. Okay. You're driving a Ferrari. And you just got passed by a Hyundai Kona. That isn't even, that should not even be considered a car. And you just got passed by it. Try and, You're not doing this right. Try, try not to get a ticket. <laughs> You're not doing this right. <laughs> sounds so much better with the top down. I wish I could drive top down everywhere. Unfortunately, yeah. It doesn't work so well at 140 on the highway. Like, yeah, like what he's doing right now, 140. <laughs> That's what I'm doing. <laughs> Not even close. We don't drive Ferraris for fuel mileage. We drive Ferraris because they're fun. Police reported ahead. Police reported ahead. Thank you, Waze. No more fun. For now. There's the cop. Yep. Yep. Thank you, Waze. You were correct. There he is. <laughs> Hello. We're not speeding. <laughs> bye bye. <laughs> this weather is so weird. We keep running in and out of these little pockets of rain. Most of them have just been really light, but this is not light. And then when we get to Chicago, it's supposed to be clear and dry. So yeah, lovely. I don't have it in me to leave the iPass on all the time. I take it down because I hate it being there, but it's so convenient. It's got to go back up for this trip. I haven't eaten yet today, so we had to make a quick food stop. And in the process, I found that. Looks like it's just a roller right now, but I have a feeling somebody's gonna do something really fun with this. Getting food now doesn't really make any sense because they're gonna have food there, but I'm starving. And they have pretzels. Pretzels. Pretzels were a good choice. Yep. I think we need some rubs for the Ferrari deal. You're welcome. 
welcome, Ferrari. That was weak, I could have done better. I promise on the way out, if it's not raining, better tunnel run. New exhaust, tunnel, it's required. Roy has failed us. Yes, he's failed us. He told me to go in that entrance, but I can't go in that entrance because that entrance is closed. Roy, you messed up. I am here for the event. Ooh -hoo. You're gonna take those? Yep. And I'm gonna take what? A piece of paper. Yep. So I'm trading you my Ferrari for a piece of paper. Exactly. <laughs> that sounds like a good deal for you. They only use the finest water for washing cars here. That's Evian that comes out of that hose. The water coming out of the hose, is it Evian or Perrier? Oh, I have no clue, man. It's only the best. Yeah, it's the best water, man. <laughs> <laughs> all right, everybody, we're gonna hope that the weather holds out for us. It's supposed to be on and off rainy all day, but we're gonna keep our fingers crossed. We're gonna get to drive the new Bentley and check it out. We're gonna get to appreciate all the amazing cars they have here. Welcome to the team! <laughs> Good to see you, Caesar. Yeah, likewise, likewise, likewise. But some... gonna be a good day today. Of course, the rain is testy. Uh... It's, it's, it's gonna hold off. It's, yeah. it's not gonna rain. No, no. We're gonna stay positive. It's not gonna rain all day. Exactly. Until I get back to Kalamazoo. No, no, perfect. There you go. <laughs> <laughs> so it appears that in the building, we're only gonna be able to do B-roll. YouTube, copyright, that's okay. We'll get some really cool B-roll in there. They've got some gorgeous cars. And uh, there's a couple Bentleys here for us to drive today. It looks like I, I've seen them. I've, I've seen the, the videos. I've seen the pictures. They're gorgeous, but I'm excited to actually get in one. Troublemaker. Took off in the uh, in the Bugatti at the auto show, and then you ended up in the Rolls Royce. <laughs> hey, you can't call me a troublemaker. My recent set of tires on the Ferrari lasted me nine days. See, troublemaker. That is not a troublemaker. Trouble. I made those last. Yeah, that's almost double digits, though. Come on. <laughs> yeah. Almost, but not quite. Hey, the next ones might last ten days. Yeah. Okay. Sure. <laughs> How are you? How you doing, Corey? Good. Good to see you. Good. Did you guys have a good drive in? Uh, we did. Got a little bit squirrely. Yeah. Uh, we ran into some rain and. I go through tires pretty quickly, so <laughs> yeah. These ones lasted me nine days. What do you do? I, I, I mean, seriously. <laughs> nine days for a set of tires? Yeah. You're insane. I found a Jeep Wrangler in the parking lot. And then I found a real Wrangler in the parking lot. Got baby Wrangler? Daddy Wrangler. Check out the 27 Quattro port. Just slightly used. Very gently, by a grandma. Just slightly used. McLaren 720 just passed by and he missed the turn like we did. Yeah. So he's gonna be coming in right over here. I think we should greet him. Thank you. My eardrums, however, do not. <laughs> what is I'm doing it for the vlog. I won't be able to hear for a week, but that was for you. This curve right here is one of my favorite curves on this car. Unless you see one of these in person, cannot do it justice. The way it diverts the air up and through and under the wing, this line just looks so sick. If I could afford a 720, one would definitely be in my garage. Wow. And that exhaust, <laughs> I'm telling you without a doubt, that is the exhaust to have. 
I don't know what it is. I don't care. It's amazing. We just got the unofficial invite to Road America, but they said it's a Lamborghini event, so I have to park my Ferrari in the sand dunes. Yes, sir. So, so I'll just leave the Ferrari at home and I'll drive a dune buggy. Nah, yeah. Or you can have the dune buggy there. So this is when you park the Ferrari, you can just take the dune buggy. Right. To or, or something to pull the Ferrari out of the sand. Exactly. Well, there you go. Road America. That's going to be fun. I'm hustling. That 720 is leaving, and I want to hear it one more time. Sometimes you just got to go stand in traffic. I know it's a Bentley event, but you cannot hide an F12 like this. That's just wrong. This thing is just sick. The creative bespoke, all the work they did to it. There's $100,000 worth of work done to this thing, and it's worth every penny. This is one of the sickest F12s I've ever seen. Time to trade in the Cali. I'm official. I can drive now. So you asked if my Cali could handle the rain. Oh yeah. So when you say handle the rain, I mean I can drive it. Can you, can you but, drive it well in the rain? Is what I mean. Sure. Sideways. <laughs> kind of like an ice skate. Good answer. Good answer. <laughs> hey wifey, I found your next car. You said you like the R8s. Really that one's for you. Not really. We can't afford it right now. Everybody go subscribe so I can afford to buy Wifey an R8. All right, guys. We were supposed to head back to Kalamazoo for a car show, but that's not happening. Senna. Chi Town Exotics. Follow him on Instagram. He gave me the inside scoop. There's a Senna here in Chicago that's way more important than a car show in Kalamazoo. So leaving Bentley, headed over there because... Senna. Have a good time, bro. Because Senna. Yes, because Senna. <laughs> Last time I was here, the people that were with me won something. So maybe it's your turn. Uh, I'm hoping for it. Stephen Wright. Stephen A. Wright. You are first. That's not you. A few moments later. Kyle Trinstra. So it appears that coming to Perilla with me means you get something. That's you get? true. True. <laughs> Bentley Polo. Good luck. I didn't get anything this time, but that's okay. Kyle did. Yep. <laughs> and I'm out here in the rain for the Bentley. For you. I, well, really, it's for me. She's all yours. You've signed your life away, so we've got uh, everything we need from you. <laughs> so keep the shiny side up. <laughs> that's, uh, that, that's the way I prefer to do it. <clears throat> I will warn you though, um, I know you're going to obey all speed limits, please do. Uh, just make sure that before you step on the loud pedal, make sure it's pointed in a straight line, but we have seen a couple of cops, so heads up. So let's see, brand new Bentley in the rain, traction control off? <laughs> this isn't one of those videos, still very tempting. 626 horsepower, rain. Oh, I forgot what that feels like. Oh, that seatbelt tightening? No, the, huh. <clears throat> the the acceleration of a Bentley is, it, it's different. It feels significantly different than most cars. The the W12 in these things, it just, the, um, the, the power, the power delivery, like when you hit that pedal, you go, but it doesn't like kick you in the back. It's not like, a punch it's I, I heard them once explained as being gentlemanly quick and that's it, it's like it's like a drag racer in a tuxedo I used to do 120 miles an hour in my Bentley all the time and it just it felt like you're doing 60 or 70 miles an hour and, and this one even takes that up to another notch it, the, the bumps that we're hitting right now that we can barely even feel would almost be teeth chattering in the Ferrari. I was not aware we were hitting bumps until you said that. <laughs> <laughs> right. And then I looked at how big they were and yeah, this is yeah, we've actually got some pretty nasty. Not the best road we're on. Yeah, if, if we were in the Ferrari right now, it, like you would feel it in your back and your like in your teeth almost. I mean, just like I said, teeth chattering. But the Bentley, it takes all the harshness out of it, and you just get like elevator smooth. 
they have a new gearbox in this too, and I have not had an opportunity. Uh, this is my first drive. I've never had an opportunity to drive one, so this is new. So we have to test the paddle shifters and see how they shift, see if there is a uh, responsive as a lot of the modern stuff. It's still a Bentley, but it's a Bentley with an auto stop start function. I actually see it right there. Why in the world? If you're driving a 626 horsepower twin turbo 12 cylinder, really? Are you doing it for fuel economy? Come on. They've, uh, they've done a lot with the exhaust note on these. Um, my 05, I needed to do exhaust mods to make it sound the way I wanted it to. And I, I, I've heard these ripping down the road before and uh, it's so much better. This is, at least you know when, when somebody drives or when you hit the loud pedal. Okay, for those of you watching at home, that was not 95 miles an hour. It was not. Yeah, it's quick. <laughs> for a 5,500 pound car, it is quick. And we probably shouldn't do that again because we were told there are police out here. I need you guys all to go subscribe. I need a million subscribers now so I can buy one of these. Please. Don't do it for the vlog. Don't do it for you. Do it for me. I need one of these. You were telling me up front well, not get to get to a Senna. That's I on you. So, if you want somebody. one, go for it. <laughs> Why don't you like the Senna? Oh like Unfortunately, Senna. I cannot comment on that. Yeah. Because you're story. a Bentley representative. Well, I've represented like, a lot of different manufacturers. So, ah. I, I have a huge respect for the car's ability. I just don't know that I would get one. So, different strokes for different folks. I'll tell you for me. Yeah. I have two things that would prohibit me from getting that. Okay. One, I can't afford it. Two, one. I don't like my cars to catch on fire. See, there, you know, you can't talk about picky. <laughs> Thank you. Just had to get one look at that custom PT Cruiser. Love the uh, riveted on bumper and the spray painted fender. That's, uh, that's a special kind of custom. Shy town Exotics gave us the hookup. We got the beautiful Chicago skyline. It actually looks so cool like this with all the cloud cover and the light rain. But we're chasing the Senna for you, for the vlog. And for me, because I've never seen a Senna. A McLaren dealer is not a place I normally find myself. I'm more of a Ferrari and Lamborghini guy. But we were told there's a Senna here and you can't pass up that opportunity. Here she is. I've never seen a Senna in real life. I've never seen one. We've all seen the videos. I've seen the videos. Everybody else has videos. I don't. Here it is. I'm excited to see one. I don't know if I would do the white with the blue and orange the blue wheels. It's a pretty killer spec, but I don't know if it's for me. That wing though, until you see one of these sitting in front of you like this, you are not gonna realize how big that wing is. That is, that is massive. That's a, that's a picnic table on the back of a car. We're doing test drives in the Senna today, right? Yeah, most definitely. I thought so, I mean like, just everybody who walks in, free test drive? Pretty much. Cool. Uh, so. Where do I get in line? No. <laughs> the Senna is an un unrealistic goal for most people. If you could have any car here, what would it have to be? I'm putting you on the spot. The red 720S. Oh, that's a good choice. Realistically, you couldn't go wrong with any of the three, but the Storm Gray, I think, is for me. So, I'm just gonna go write a check. You drive the California home. Okay. <laughs> And uh, hopefully they're going to realize in a couple days that that check was nowhere near good. <laughs> At which point we'll be cruising through Mexico. Oh my word. Oh come on, it's only $348,000.
348,000 pesos, <laughs> I, I'm there. So I was telling Kyle that I would have the storm gray, but I lied because they're hiding this. I couldn't see it from over there. That would be the one. Sure, that's as much fun to drive in the rain as this is. Well, we just did the exhaust yesterday and I haven't had a chance to do a true tunnel run, but thank you Chicago and sorry. Sorry, Chicago, and you're welcome. Carrillo party's over. All you can eat sushi. Yep, we need sushi. Well guys, thank you for watching. Thank you for sharing our Perillo day with us. I'm pretty sure Kyle had a blast on his oh, first... Oh, yes, I did. Yes, I did. <laughs> first supercar day, and he got to drive the Ferrari. Now, I'm going to drive the Ferrari because we're still running on those, uh, those slicks. And uh, it's supposed to rain all the way back to Kalamazoo, so aren't we lucky? We're going to go ice skating all the way home. <laughs> you ready? Yes, I am. Let's go. <laughs> Hopefully, I don't scare the crap out of you. <laughs> no walls. No walls. <laughs> Bye, everybody. Oh, <laughs>